This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. Anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See them thick and see man locking that data. But like I tell every day, the data release us is false. Many gives us a false narrative to markets so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, um, Marion from Miami put this on my radar and it seems that UBS might have been the purchaser of the 45 million at the market GME shares that Ryan Cohen sold this week and it appeared that they have a lot of call options that's going to be going in that's going to expire rather within the next few weeks and if this is true if UBS picked up these 45 million GME shares in order to hedge these call positions as these whole as these call positions slowly expire it is going to put some pressure on the bad actors who are naked shorting GME I'm going to tell you guys something. Everybody knows by now that UBS inherited all that bad paper from Credit Suisse who inherited it from Arcagos. But it seems that UBS is trying to fix the problem. But by fixing the problem, in my opinion, this can cause GME to run to all-time highs. That's going to make 2021 look like a cakewalk. Okay. Now, I don't have any evidence whatsoever that UBS is a purchaser of those 45 billion GME shares that were sold at the money over $20. But if this is true, we're going to see some real volatility in the market in the next few weeks as these call options go to expiration and of course we know the cat system is going online on march 31st we know the t plus one starts on may 28th so i mean as uncle frank like to say there's a lot of black and white swans that that be, could happen in the next few weeks and put a lot of pressure on the bad actors at this point, and this is just my opinion, I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell GME, but I believe just holding and sitting back with some AMC, AMC popcorn and watching the fireworks because I believe some big dogs are about to go down before the end of June because of all the fraud and corruption in the GME play. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think that UBS is a buyer of the 45 million GME shares that were sold at the market price? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.